Hey, I wanted to share with you our practical making remedies and growing course that is for herbal medicine practitioners and herbal medicine students. This is um, a two day course that myself and Ross run together. And as I said in the past, we've had herbalists on this course that have 20 years experience in clinical practice to herbal medicine students who are finishing up their studies. Um, and it's a really great two days because it's a full immersion into everything you would need to know to grow the herbal medicine plants and for your own clinical practice and to make remedies yourself from those plants. And um, so on the first day, Ross really takes you through all the growing aspects of the plants and really particular to your clinical practice. So all everything from how to sow the seeds, how to propagate the seeds, how to actually tend the plants and care for the plants, how to tend for the roots, um, and how to properly maintain these plants in your garden if you want to be able to make medicines for your own practice from these plants. And as you know, we're all different as herbalists and some of us like to use some plants a lot and some of us like to use some plants just a little bit. So that really does dictate what kind of plants you want to grow in your garden as a herbalist um, and how many of those plants you might need or want to grow if you're going to tincture them or if you're going to dry them um, or if you're going to make other remedies out of them. So Ross takes you through all of that and he does a really intense focus as well on tincture making, which is his speciality, um, and so how we tincture all our plants here at Ivywood, um, and how we make these amazing fresh tinctures for our clinical practice. So that, that's a lot around day one, and on day two, what we do is we're actually gonna get cooking up and making remedies, and we're gonna be talking a lot about phytochemistry, we are gonna be going really in depth into medical conditions as well, um, as we're all herbalists, it's a really nice thing that we can just cut to the chase um, and we can go really in depth in, into these things when you're making remedies. So whether they're internal remedies that you're going to make for your patients that are tinctures or vinegars or oils or glycerides or whether they're remedies that are for external applications, whether it's lotions or creams or ointments or liniments or compresses. So we make them all in our clinical practice and that's what it's about when you would need to utilize those kind of remedies for your clinical practice and how to do this really easily. And one of the things I really love about being a herbal medicine practitioner is that in clinic, I don't just dispense tinctures and dry tea mixes, I actually make a lot of remedies. We have a massive stock in our dispensary of herbal oils that we make every year and oxymels and vinegars and creams and lotions and all of those things are able to be made up really quick into remedies for people and during the consultation. So sometimes I might be in consultation, I might be going out and harvesting some plants right then and then making something really quick for a patient before they leave. And I love that aspect of herbal medicine. For me, it's, it's a whole more rounded way of practice. Um, and that's really what we want to encourage. We really want to encourage other herbalists to have their own sustainable supply of herbal medicines for their clinical practice and for them to actually connect with the plants more. Um, and that actually allows you to connect with your patients more. And it's a wonderful thing to be able to offer your patients all that all the remedies and all the tinctures made in your clinic come from your garden so that's what we do here at Ivywood and we really want to inspire other herbalists to be able to do that and give them the knowledge as well and share with them the knowledge to do that too and um, so this uh, these two days we take 12 people on the course and I know there's already people booked in for this course and we only are going to run it once this year in 2023 here at Ivywood and um, so if you are interested do um, check out the link to book your place um, but yeah, it's two days and one of the nicest things I think about it is that you're actually with a group of herbalists. These are your colleagues that you practice with. Um, so it's really nice to spend the two days with colleagues and there is a lot of sharing of experience and clinical experience while we're mixing up ointments and while we're making glycerides. And that's really invaluable. I think that's a really precious thing to have that connection with other practitioners. Um, so yeah, so and you also get to take home a lot of things. So you get to take home loads of the plants that you worked with over the two days um, and everything you've potted on or things that you've split off and herbs so you get to take home a whole range of plants that will already be able to be you'll be able to put into your garden at home um, and then all the remedies that we've made um, over the two days as well so it's a really great thing to be able to um, give you some confidence um, and maybe just add some extra aspects um, of herb medicine into your clinical practice so yeah, if you're interested in joining us here at Ivywood um, as a herbal practitioner, um, we would be delighted to have you. Thanks.